what is going on everybody welcome back to the EV Games Expo I am back once again with Chris uh, at the TT Esports booth and he's going to be taking us through his products once again yeah, how's it going guys? What we do is uh, we'll start off just with the peripheral shelf over here. So basically, as Dean said, my name's Chris. I'm the community esports manager of TD Esports. What I do is I'm like the gamer who connects the business with the gamers. So I understand games. I've been playing competitive games for a long time myself as well as casual. So what we like to do is get feedback from you guys and uh, come to these kind of shows, get some more feedback from everybody and uh, show off our new stuff. So a uh, pretty cool mouse we have here that I want to show you is the Talon Blue mouse. It's called the Talon Blue because it is blue in colour. It's got two macro keys on the side, a 3000 DPI optical sensor on the bottom which also glows blue. The reason it has an optical sensor and a very simple design is it's going to be coming out in a couple of months time for only 35 bucks. So it's absolutely rock bottom cheap and it provides you all of the features which you'll get with any other mouse that you'd look at. For keyboards, we've got a couple new ones coming out. We've got the Challenger Go keyboard. The Challenger Go keyboard is uh, like the next iteration of our Challenger Pro. So it gives you all the macro keys on the side. It gives you a nice cool blue backlighting across all of it and media keys. And there's also the Challenger Prime. So this has a funky little DJ wheel here which controls the lights. It's got three different backlighting options. Also got macro keys and media keys. And these two keyboards are only going to be coming in at 35 bucks as well. So 35 bucks for the keyboards, 35 bucks for the mice as well. An absolute great price point. Because what we want to do is we want to help give back to the gamers. There's no reason that you need to spend $200 on a keyboard, $200 on a mouse, because they just don't, simply don't need to cost that much. So a cool case we have on display here is the new Core V1. This is actually designed by a marketing team in America. They love to go to lots of massive LAN events and want to take a PC along to play with the public, but uh, want something a little bit better than a laptop, a bit more beefy. So what we've done here with the Core V1 is it's got three side panels that are all interchangeable. So you can actually have any combination you want whatsoever. You can have a mesh side panel, you can have a window, you can have all three of them as one. You can fit a full-size graphics card in here as well. This is an EVGA 780 sitting in here. We've got our two sticks of Kingston RAM in here and a Kingston HyperX SSD an all-in-one water cooler, We've got a front fan on as well. All that fits in this case, as well as a massive full-size power supply. This case comes in at only 59 bucks. It fits absolutely everything in here that you would get in a normal mid-tower for only $59. So the last section we have here is the headphone section. We've got a massive, what we call, hashtag wall of sound base in your face. And this is just so people can come along and try out all the headsets that we have. Things like a Birdo headset, Grey's an all-rounder. Level 10 headset, which is designed by the guys who don't design BMW M-series cars. We've got a Kronos cool little headset with LEDs on it. And also an FPS King, the Draco Kaplan headset, which was also helped design by White Rather, Ukrainian StarCraft 2 player. So guys, make sure you check us out on Facebook at our TD Sports or Thermal Take AU for such so we'll take you and uh, check out our website as well for any new products coming out. We'll uh, be sure to see you at some land parties soon.